In the world of psychology, there are two important concepts called accommodation and assimilation. These ideas were developed by a psychologist named Jean Piaget. What is accommodation? Accommodation is when you change your ideas or thoughts to fit new information. It's like when you rearrange your room to fit a new piece of furniture. For example, imagine you believe all birds can fly. Then one day you see a penguin, which can't fly. To accommodate this new information, you adjust your belief to include birds that can't fly. What is assimilation? Assimilation is when you fit new information into your existing ideas or thoughts. It's like when you add a new book to your bookshelf. For example, let's say you have a belief that all animals with four legs are dogs. Then you see a cat. Instead of changing your belief, you say, oh, this cat is like a dog because it has four legs. You've assimilated the new information into your existing belief. How do they work together? Accommodation and assimilation often work together when we learn new things. Imagine you have a jar that represents your mind. This jar is your brain, and it can hold your ideas and thoughts. When you learn something new, it's like adding more marbles to the jar. Assimilation is when you put marbles that are similar to the ones already in the jar. Accommodation is when you adjust the shape or size of the jar to fit new marbles that are different. So as you learn, you're constantly adding new marbles, information, and adjusting the jar, your ideas, to fit them. Real life examples. Let's look at some everyday examples of accommodation and assimilation. Learning a new language. When you learn a new word in a different language, you might assimilate it into your existing vocabulary if it sounds similar to a word you already know. But if it's very different, you might accommodate it by creating a new category for words that sound like that. Trying new foods. If you've never tasted sushi before, you might need to accommodate your idea of what good food is once you try it. But if you already like seafood, you might assimilate sushi into that category. Accommodation and assimilation are like two sides of the same coin. They both help us learn and understand the world around us. Sometimes we adjust our existing ideas to fit new information, and other times we fit new information into our existing ideas.